Hello, and welcome to another one of my world famous puzzles. My name is Morris, and I'm a cat, and I like to solve puzzles. Have you ever heard the phrase square peg in a round hole? Well, this one asks the question what is the tighter fit? A square peg in a round hole? Or a round peg in a square hole? My not very bright assistant will explain further. Thank you, Morris. Although I think you have summed up the puzzle completely. What is the tightest fit? A square peg in a round hole? Or a round peg in a square hole? Work out your answer in terms of a percentage fit. As usual, we will just slow down for a few seconds, giving you a chance to pause the video if you want to solve the problem yourselves. We will be given the answer in just a few seconds. If like Morris the Cat and me, you like puzzles, then why not subscribe to our YouTube channel at the end of this video. Here is the answer. Let us first consider a square peg in a round hole. If we let the round peg have a radius r, then that means the square's diagonal measures 2r. The triangle formed by the square's diagonal and its two sides is an isosceles right angled triangle. By the Pythagorean theorem, we can solve for the square's side, which is r root 2. The square's area is the square of the side, so it is 2r squared. This is to be divided by the circle's area, pi r squared. The ratio of the square peg's area to the round hole is 2r squared divided by pi r squared, which equals 2 over pi, which is around about 64%. Now we calculate the other way around, a round peg in a square hole. The circle's radius is again r, so the square hole has a side of 2r, and an area of 4r squared. The round peg has an area of pi r squared. So, the ratio of the round peg's area to the square hole is around 79%. This means a round peg in a square hole is a better fit than a square peg in a round hole. Thank you, Mr. Assistant, for walking us through the puzzle. If, like me, you like puzzles, then why don't you subscribe to our YouTube channel? It's free and it will make sure you don't miss any future puzzles that I may post. Bye bye, keep puzzling.